Hello everyone, welcome back to MathMod. Happy to see you here. Really interesting algebra problem today, tricky problem today, because we need to subtract. We have 35 square minus 21 square, and we need to find our answer. How can you do this? Of course, you can raise this to the second power. You can subtract this element using the second power. We have 21 times 21, but I will show you a really good trick right here. Take a look. We have 35 square. We signal out that this is some number to the second power. And right here, there is another number minus b square and if you look closely this is our formula we can split it into an identity we have a minus b times a plus b so i hope you all know this formula you need to know this formula this is a classic mass this is a classic algebra formula that we need every time in algebra so let's use this formula right here we have difference of squares a minus b and a plus b we will have 35 minus 21 and times 35 plus 21 so we just write it using this, using this formula. But what we will have as a result? Take a look closely. 35 minus 21, we can easily find this answer. It will be equal to 14. And we multiply by 35 plus 21. It will be equal to times 56. How can we find this, this answer? How can we simplify? How, how can we find our, this answer not multiplying these uh, this elements? Because we know that 14 is good number because we can write it in only in one way we can express only as 7 times 2 so we express this as 7 times 2 and 56 is as well really good number because we can write it as 8 times 7 so we hope you understand this step just write as 14 as 7 times 2 as uh, 56 as 8 times 7 so what we're going to do next take a look closely we have 7 and we have 7 as well if we multiply we have 49 and moreover, we can bring this 49 outside of this square root, but we need to find the square root. Square root of 49 will be 7. 7. And in our square root sign, we'll have 2 times 8. 2 times 8. 2 times 8 will be equal to 16. And take a look closely. Square root of 16 equal to 4. So 7 times 4 equal to 28. And we find our answer using these tricky, for, tricky, tricky methods. And of course, step by step, we find our square root sign not raising this element to the second power, which is really good for us. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And of course, happy to see you here. See you in the next videos. Thank you for watching.